Okay, so... Since last time, basically, I have done a little bit of crafting. I didn't think you guys wanted to see that. As you can see, Feindal here has got a, a nice new sword. And I have done a little bit of crafting on um, Uthgird's armour to make it slightly higher quality. So, um, I've also been told a few things. That, so, for example, the you know commands, when I said you're, you're important, it made her invulnerable, which might explain why she's still alive. And if I... In combat, mistakes happen. Apparently, she can now die. One-handed, two-handed, and heavy. Okay, so I've got her set up okay. So... And speaking of magic... Forget you have a new magic. It is a vile art. Okay. Let's go. She doesn't know any magic anyway. I'm still there. Um, So, got her sorted out now, so she's now mortal. She can now die. And I've also installed a mod called Resurrect Spell. So I can buy spells to resurrect my followers if they die and if I can be bothered. Still here. So I'm not totally sure I would waste the money on him. Because it costs 150. In combats, mistakes happen. Forgive and forget. There you go. Um, and I've, I've also been told that if I what do you want me to carry? Remove his new fine small sword, he will use only his bow. So I'm going to remove this for now. And I'm going to leave him his hunting bow so that he always uses this because I think he looks a bit wimpy. I, I should actually get him some armor, I guess. In fact, definitely I should get him some armor. But I want him to use his you bow and bow armor. only. Oh, and uh, last time I had somehow got my right difficulty set to expert. Now it's master. That's another reason it felt a little easy. I was also told that one of the reasons the last dungeon I crawled through was easy was due to the fact that I was such a low level that the dungeon leveled with me, but my, my followers were both level 6, which made them monstrously overpowered. So anyway, I've now got a taste for adventure, and I can head off to college, and I'm going to pick up um, a carriage at Whiterun, but I've noticed that on my way to Whiterun, there is a um, another quest, so I'm going to stop off here, and try and retrieve his family sword before I go off to college. See? Saves time. So that is where I'm going to run to now. I'm st I've been told that this horse has been put here by the UFO mod. Um, so I can steal it for one of my followers maybe. But I, I've no idea what would happen if I stole it and I'm really not powerful enough to wipe out the entire town of <laughs> Riverwood quite yet. So, just going to ignore that and head off. Oh, now one of the other mods I've installed is a mod that adds lanterns. I can't quite remember what it's called, actually. It adds lanterns to cities and to bridges. Um, so, hopefully that's going to make nighttime a little bit uh, easier. We will see. But I always like those sort of things. So in games like Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 3, I always used a mod that added street lamps. In New Vegas, I used Electro City. So I'm glad to see something like that here. I think it adds a little... Um, especially if you're using Darker Nights, it adds a little more light. And I think it looks cool. This, that. I have nothing to say to you. Now move along, or I'll order my guards to attack. Guards. I see one guard. I see one guard. Go on, order him to attack. I have nothing to say to you. Now move along, or I'll order my guards to attack. He's not actually doing it though, is he? Notice that. He's not actually ordering the guard to attack me. Go 
God, that's depressingly rainy. Oh, more lanterns. Yes. Attention deficit disorder here. Ooh, shiny thing. I think it's pretty cool, actually. Even when it's not night time, I think it adds a little... Um, it adds a little point of interest on the on the roads. Well, you can see them there on the way to White Run. That's pretty nice. Anyway, not going to White Run yet. Heading off to find this that uh, the Red Guard. I can never remember his name. The Red Guard's family sword, which is over in this direction. Oh, one of the things I've uh, found from doing the, this Let's Play is the number of people who give me a lot of helpful advice because I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing with followers. I've never played with followers before. And I've been told that I can actually tell my followers to attack simply by putting my crosshair on an opponent and clicking the same key I would to talk. So I'm going to try that. This guy's coming. Where's my uh, quest? Up there. Ah! I've been wandering alone for so long, I thought I'd never see another soul again. You scared me off to death, woman. It's like my screen suddenly got possessed and made me turn. Calm down, tell I me what happened. I was kidnapped by these bandits weeks ago. They locked me up in the towers near Mistwatch. I managed to pick the lock and slip out while the guard slept. But now, I'm completely lost. Can you help me, please? I don't know. Can you pay me? There's a town nearby in that direction. Do you need any help? Oh, thank you. But I should be fine now that you've shown me the way. <laughs> that's good, because even stopped. though that's the only option, I was not Here, actually going to help you. you. you know. If you can stop them, you'll be a true hero. Actually, they sound like the sort of people I'd like to recruit. A bunch of people kidnapping locals. I might pay them a visit and see if they want to work for me. I need enterprising people in my horde. Um, I need to remind myself what uh, spells I'm using. Yeah, I've, uh, I've not played for several days, been very busy, so getting back in the scheme of things. I still like Fury. I love making people kill each other. I know there's someone waiting up here for me. There we go. I really am a terrible shot today. Oh! Kill cab. Oh. Yeah, sorry about that. I really wasn't trying to shoot you. I'm just going to loot the bandit. No to Rudolph. Rud Rudolph? Oh, silly name. And, oh! Of course. Minion. Kill him. Anything for me to loot? Chest. And can I... Yes. Uh, people ask me whether this, oh, this spell I'm using to open chests is a mod. The answer is yes. I you used to use the Midas Magic mod, which has an open spell and a Resurrect spell, but I'm testing out Fenderix Magic and I don't want to get them mixed up, so I am missing open and Resurrect spells, so I have installed mods that add those two spells separately. Got any arrows for my minion? Tell you what I am gonna find. I'm gonna find a mod that turns the um, the moaning of zombies off. Because I don't know about you, I find it a little bit creepy. Yes, I realise the irony in being creeped out by a zombie, not because he's a zombie, but because he is moaning. That rain is really loud as well. Yay. 
who's there? Oh, oh no. Ulf the Blind. And you? Yeah, that's me. Boss was looking for you, said he'd be up at the summit. <laughs> Better not keep him waiting. Oh. You know what? I'm evil, but even I'm not evil enough to kill this guy. Read Ulf's book. <laughs> oh, very funny. Yes, yes. Dear, oh dear. Terrible sense of humor. Torch time. Dungeons are still a little bit dark. Oh, is that a shadow? It is. Kill each other! Excellent. Just a scratch. I don't know, don't you? Don't you dare. Dare hurt my follower. Ooh, a caster minion. You know what? She's still amazingly hard. Maybe I should give fur armor to uh, Feindal at some point. Destruction. Ah, oh, very useful. I've never been into alchemy in any of these type of games. I'm just... It's one of those things that just never appeals to me. Crafting, not as much. Not a bigger problem. Rage! I just cast Rage on it. Why isn't she fighting it, everyone? Yes, excellent. Well done. Supposed to be fine each other. Okay, who shot me? See what I'm healing. Oh, wuss. You're a fool to fight me. Kill him. Oh, that's probably not a good idea. Just let the wolves out. Probably not my smartest move. Ah. Oh. Fortunately for me, the wolf is helping me out. Excellent. Anything for me to loot? A bow. Oh, they banned it. dark in here. I need the candlelight spell for sure. Definitely. Uh, that is just so creepy. Pickaxe! Yes, I need one of those. I want to do lots of mining, which I'm sure will be very interesting for you guys to watch. to be um, wanting to fall over and die. How come my minions can't get here? Why aren't my minions engaging? Thank you. Okay, I think it's time to do the Berserker Rage. Not quite good enough, are you? I don't have the Zikar I've already used it up. I was a little bit worried about her for a second. I 
because I like her. I don't want her to die. He's got a journal. I am arrows. Value 400. Oh, 200 attacks do 15% more damage. I don't need them, but I can use them for... Reach everything anyway. I'm going to sell it, aren't I? Iron Greatsword. The Family Sword. Yes, quest done. Oh, lots of gold. Excellent. Can I get down here? I don't want to... Look at that. I almost missed a coin purse. So... I'm going to see if I can get down here. Ah, no problem. Now I'm off to White Run to reap my rewards, and then I'm off to college. Now, I am trying to avoid using fast travel because uh, generally it, I think it spoils the flow of the story. But I also appreciate it's probably pretty boring to watch. So I'll probably be cutting out a lot of these long journey parts. Now, I'm also using a new mod that enhances the travel. You need a ride? So let's see. I'd like to hire your Where carriage. You no, that's not done anything. I would, I, I'm not totally sure. I saw it and installed it, and I have yet to quite figure out what is going on. I can probably I buy a horse, war horse I but I don't really want one strong. yet. I want to save my money for spells. But yes, yeah, so I've installed a better fast travel mod. Um, it has alternative carriages and even boats so that you don't need to use the fast travel as much so you don't need to use you know go to the map and fast travel from there which i like because it's slightly more immersive okay so let's get all these quests finished everything sold buy some spells and get off to college i don't claim to be the best blacksmith in white run I've turned on subtitles for the dialogues. Hopefully, this will help. Do you work at the forge all day? This sounds like a. This is a quest start, isn't it? got to. If I hope to be as good as There you go. In fact, I just finished my best piece of work. It's a sword. I made it for the Jarl, Balgruf the Greater. It's a surprise. I don't even know if he'll accept it, but listen. Could you take the sword to my father? Will I get paid? He's the Jarl steward. He'll know the right time to present it to him. Sure, sure. I'm expecting Thanks. payment, though. However, what I want to do is sell some stuff. Let's have a look. What have I got? Uh, hunting bow. We've already, he's already got one of those, and I'm not going to use a weapon, so sell. 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 Iron great sword. Sell. Sell. Just everything. We're going to keep this. This is Fendo, whatever his name is, sword. If I decide to give him it. And I'm going to give him some armor. So I'm going to keep those. And I'm going to get rid of... 200... I'm going to give that to my minion. Definitely. Definitely give that to my minion. And that will do. I need Don't to do some to crafting. Shot, Unfortunately... Anyone hurts you, you make them pay. Oh, what do you think this is? Go mental. I'll have to check this one out, but... Mm, I'm going to find out what that is before I enable that. I've got this hugely horrible suspicion I'm going to get myself in trouble. You've stopped. What I want to it? trade something with you. What do you need to take? I'm going to take your gauntlets and I'm going to give you these. And let's have a look. The You've already got one, haven't you? What have you got? Fine steel. There you go. So, let's go. Where's my other minion? I'm right behind you. Um, bada 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 bada. I need to trade some things. What do you want me to carry? I want 
want you to give me those revolting boots and then I want you to put on at least some armor. It's not much. You look pretty goofy actually, but you look a bit more like a wood elf now. Yeah, okay, you'll do. Um, and I can sell That's the rubbish I just took off you. Oh no, I'm not. I'm going to wear the gauntlets. Those gauntlets. The steel plate gauntlets. Instead of my steel Nordic gauntlets. They're better armor and they look pretty cool. I could also take her um, chest piece. But I really don't like the look of it. Let's have a look. Workbench. Steel plate. Oh, I need corundum. Yeah, yeah. I'm probably saying it wrong. I have no idea how to say that. It is not a word commonly found where I grew up. Unlike many other words, I seem to get grief over. All right. I need a. I need an ingot for that. I will do that another time. Oh, now I've got the family sword to give to someone else as well, miscellaneous. Return his sword and deliver that sword. And of course I'm using my own mod, Immersive Hood, which gives me the ability to turn off my compass and quest markers as I see fit, which is nice, because I don't like compasses and I don't like floating quest markers like that. But they are very useful. So rather than constantly checking my map or running around Whiterun for an hour and a half, Sometimes I miss the soldier's life. I have a sword. Found it. I've been looking for that blade for Give months. me a reward. You yeah. took on all those bandits yourself? Yes, it was easy, because my minions are awesome. Here. My father had a oh, I forgot. Sword and yeah, no, he doesn't give you, a, doesn't give you anything, does he? Just teaches you how to use weapons that I have sworn never to use, ever. Go away. Right, then. Oh, now, some people have asked for subtitles, and I've turned on subtitles for when I'm in a conversation. But I don't have them on for when um, when I pass people. So, for example, do people really want subtitles for that sort of thing? I mean, to, to be honest, I don't really care what they're saying either. It's background noise. So I'd rather not have, you know, arrow in the knee subtitles non-stop. Okay. Let's go and claim a few more quest prizes and get rid of this great big stone. Really is annoying. There we go. The Jarl is as you I have a sword for you. What ah, do you have this for must me? Be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgruff when his mood is agreeable. Thank you. Please. Take these few coins. Coins. Coins are good. services rendered. Yes. Twenty. <sighs> you weren't kidding when you said a Enjoy few, your were you? Reach. You see, the terminology is. Oh, hello, Delphine. Nice earlier. outfit. I'm convinced this is a copy of a much older text. <coughs> I have money. I am going yes. to spend After money. War. That's well, Fendrick's followers menu. What? Um. I have no idea what that is, but I'm going to ignore it. Um, what have you got for sale? Give me some spells. You've got to try some of these now. Ooh. Spectral arrow. Ah, this allows you to use conjuration to do damage to your enemies. That's actually a nice idea. That way I don't have to do two schools, like destruction and conjuration. And I like conjuration, so I think that's definitely an option. Stutter time. Interesting. Uh, don't know what that one is. Looks a bit weird. Lots of destruction spells. Not familiar spells. Chicken. <laughs> Chicken familiar. Oh, that's cool. Uh, horse. Cow. <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. Oh, should I have a cow familiar? Rabbit. I wonder if it's just a normal little bunny rabbit, or is it some vicious killing machine? It's not a rabbit! It's the most foul-tempered, evil rodent you've ever met! Probably not. It's probably just a rabbit, isn't it? You bounce around and get eaten by whatever. Yeah. 
telekinetic phantom attack that does 19 damage. So this is a touch spell, and this is a long range. Ah, oh, so this is using illusion to damage people physically. That's interesting. What's Fenderix pulled? Uh, might buy those. Might be interesting to read. I'm going to read them. Resistance field. Oh, see. Yeah, I quite like these. Restoration has a perk that when you heal also returns stamina, which is really nice. But these he's now added spells that just do exactly that, which is probably useful. I think I'm going to use these eventually. Ah, and oh, I see what he's done. He's basically added direct damage spells to all the schools um, at the same time as adding a hell of a lot more to destruction. But it means you can have a mage that's restoration based and still damage people, which is nice. <gasps> skeletal archer, skeletal warrior, ghosts. Oh, I have to get skeletons, skeletal archer, skeletal warrior. Oh, I'm having, yes, yes, that's what I want. <laughs> oh, ooh. What did I just oh was it speechcraft or something? Yeah, okay. And I've got three I've only got three hundred gold left. I'm gonna save that. I might need it in a while. Oh mm -hmm. let's see. New spells, new spells. Um oh I have to read them first. Oh, journals. Boring. Note to Rudolf Rodulf. Silly name. Uh -huh. What are these Fenderix books? Oh, interesting. You can um, you can vote on spells. Okay, that's kind of interesting. <laughs> Little immersion breaking, but a definitely an interesting idea. Let's have a look. Oh, he's basically he's put some in-game things for you to read, so you don't actually have to go back to his page, which is probably kind of useful considering we're all fairly lazy. Right, let's learn those two. Oh, have no fear. Where is my summoning? Hey, look. <laughs> so, Archer, Warrior. Himself has finally taken an interest. So I'm now able to take my time to this Oh yeah. Time is running, Barngard. Skeletal Archer. This let's have a read of it. How long does it last? Permanent, permanent. It means I don't have to keep casting it. That's that's kind of powerful, actually. That is very powerful. I, I wonder if you still gain conjuration while in fights, while this is... It saves you having to keep summoning it over and over again, though, so it's kind of interesting. Oh, right, so this is the Fenderix mod allows me to get stats. I'm right behind on Let's get going then. my followers that have been stump summoned to you, whatever. Um, skeletal warrior. Oh, I can only have one. There's still, it's, there's still a limit. Now, in the perk tree, you the one of the final perks you can take allows you to have two. But I know there are some mods that actually allow me to get more as I progress in levels. So eventually I could have four or five summoned creatures. I may use one of those. It might be a little overpowered, though, with using unlimited followers and sort of like five or six summoned creatures. I'm basically going to be unstoppable. Although I, I find I can almost live with that concept. I'll tell you what would be really cool. I don't know if Fenderix watches this video. I know he caught one of them. When summoning, instead of him appearing like that, can you have him appear underneath the ground and then slowly get moved up while some little special effects happen on the ground like the earth is opening up so it's like he's crawling out of the ground because that would i would basically lose my mind that would be incredible but either way <laughs> three minions and he's permanent and <laughs> i get to walk around town with a hello guys how you doing bless you may the ground you walk there's a skeleton with a bow stood behind you mate and he doesn't care awesome Awesome. Oh, and I. Ah, the what? Stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. Seems you are a cut above I just went near him and he spoke to me. I was trying to. Fine. What about a reward? Have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Nice. 
My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. That would be Delphine in the location by me cloak and so dagger outfit. To share with me. So your information was correct after all. And we have our friend here yeah, to yeah. thank for recovering. Let's pretend we don't know who she yes, is. Yes, we I haven't got all day. Arcane like Enchanter. That? Let's disenchant. Nice work. This. Just send me a copy when Barangar. you decipher it. Barangar, you need <clears> to come <throat> at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. Okay, in a left. This you should come too. Okay. The There's a giant skeleton stood behind you. Where was it this is not bothering you in the doing? slightest? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. She's definitely got a bit of a butch walk. I know she's Let's wearing go. kind of armor and it probably makes you walk a bit butch, but seriously, has she got footballs under her arms or something? I do like her though. So, your left tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? She looks more yes, butch than the Yarl, though. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. No, oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Mm -hmm. Okay, so this I guess this is the sort of time when you guys actually want subtitles during the game. I, I just I don't know if that's gonna be distracting. Attacking the watchtower. No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me for sure. Good work, son. I'll try it with we'll subtitles on. Tell me if you Get like it. Tell me if you don't. Rest. I guess it's easier for non English speaking people. You'd better gather some guards. Oh, God down. knows how you understand a word I say. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. I love her voice. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. Why am I, I not surprised? I want you to go surprised. with Irelef and help her fight this dragon. <laughs> you survived Helgen. Yeah. So you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't uh, forgotten I survived the service Helgen. you did for me in retrieving the dragon side note. stone for Farnagar. Helgen in Norwegian either means As saint the or the esteem. weekend. I have so when he says Avenici that, you that I survived Helgen, I keep thinking he means I survived the weekend. Which <laughs> sounds gift pretty good. From my personal armor. Oh, gift. Come, along. Come again. Very much Iron like Helm of dragon. Minor Alteration. No, I can't afford to risk both of you. Well, let's have a look. That sounds interesting. Alteration spells, which I don't really use. And the armor rating 17 as opposed to my 20. Ooh, 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 ooh. Meh. I don't really use... Mind you, I gotta admit, I actually think I prefer the Iron Helm. need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. Put it to the vote. As you command, what do you think? Iron Helm or Steel Helm? This isn't a death or glory mission. Uh, I'm, I'm sort of. I need to know. I'm liking the Iron Helm. I guess I'm just associated Don't with worry, the Malone. Dragonborn now. I'm the very soul of court. Help Irelef kill this dragon before it can attack. Oh yeah, run. help. There's no time to lose. Help, crazy help. lady. I hope you get there in time. Wait a minute. She's not moving. Looks like she's a bit stuck. Yes, I will help the crazy lady fight the enormous 500-ton fire-breathing lizard. Because that's what I do. Yes. Minions for it. She does run funny. I do like her though. It's the accent. I, I think it's. She just sounds so educated, so knowledgeable, and yet apparently is so willing to do mind-numbingly stupid thing when her master tells her. She'd make a great minion. She would. She'd just make an absolutely brilliant minion. I spend a lot of time at the market stall, so I can learn the merchant's trade. Jesus, depressing. Do you see what I mean about the uh, subtitles, though? Little distracting when you're trying to ignore people like that. So, <laughs> they want me to run off at level 5 or 6 or whatever I am. What am I? Level. Ooh! I've leveled. I'm actually going to take Magicka, you know. I'm going to take Magicka. I'm using a new mod, actually, that changes the...
skill tree. It makes it a bit clearer, makes it a little nicer to look at. I'll have to do some comparison shots, but um, we will see. Conjuration. Well, I'm less worried about this knife. I've got a permanent... Yeah, I mean, I've got a permanent summoned creature. A bit overpowered, really, isn't it? Restoration. I could have cheaper restoration. Alteration. I, I keep thinking I'm going to use alteration, but I've not got around to it. Smithing. Nah, I've not done enough smithing. I've got to use all my leather and do some smithing and... It's always dead boring, that. And then heavy armor. Ooh, I just, I just can't decide. Conjuration dual casting. See, that lasts longer, but as I said, not really much of a problem anymore. Bound weapons. You know what? I'll make that decision another time. I work with my mother. I'm going to college. Hmm. I'm not noticing any lanterns around Whiterun yet. Did anyone notice any? I didn't. Nope. Bit disappointing. I wonder where they are. I know I've installed two mods, one for cities and one for roads. Probably hasn't got around to doing Whiterun yet. dark, isn't it? So, leaving sunny old White Run behind, off to college. Did someone see some flickering flames? Oh, that's Iraleth and her company. Off to fight your dragon. Good luck with that, guys. Because, um... I don't think you're going to survive. <laughs> My best friend's a dragon. He's awesome. Me? <laughs> I'm off to college. You guys are nuts. Need a ride? I want to go to college. Where do you want to go? College. Winter hold. Climb and back and we'll be off. Yes! Let's go, guys. College. Toga parties. Keggers. Lots of fun. Party time. Oh, and becoming master of the universe. That sort of thing. It's going to be great. What do you need? It's a bit bleak, isn't it? Really. I mean, it doesn't seem to matter how many times I come here, my first impression is, good God. Ah, well, it's going to be a long, long semester. <laughs>